You are always possibility. You are always connected to that energy which can become anything at any moment. So you are formless just like source. We recognize that source, God, is energy. It's not a man. It's not a person, place, or thing. It's not a building. It's not a temple. It's not a house. It's formless. Like Play-Doh, it can become anything. You can form it into anything. Like a box of Legos, you can make it into anything, destroy it, and make it into something else. Well, you are just like that. The form that you inhabit is your creation. It listens to you. Your body listens to you. Your financial life listens to you. Your relationship life listens to you. Your family life listens to you. Because the form that you inhabit is your creation. I was talking to Pastor Yolanda, I think it was last Sunday we were talking about this, and it was just, it was coming to me so clearly, the idea that if we want to change our bodies in any way, right, if we want to release weight, if we want to just get six-pack abs, if we, um, if, if we want to change a situation because we have an illness in our body, although it seems counterintuitive, the first thing that we must do using our superpower of imagination is speak love to our body. Because we think that this thing is the problem, and I want this thing to change, so why would I say something kind to it? But this thing is your creation. It's the Play-Doh. It's the, the stuff that can be moved and shaped, and shaped in any way you want. So when you understand that, that the form that you inhabit is your creation, it listens to you. The first thing you must do if you want to change in your physical form is love on you. And that requires using your superpower of imagination to do that. 